Senior year. It's been fun all right. I had the chance to stage manage my last high school theater performance, go to the beach with my dog, hang out with my friends without a care in the world. But then, everything changed. Classes are now online. Going outside is limited to exercise and grocery shopping. Seeing friends, we can only do it through Zoom or house party. Events like graduation, prom, sports leagues, all gone. Theater festival, my last chance to write and direct a play with my friends, canceled. This change was inevitable as COVID-19 became a pandemic. But how do you deal with change? How do you make the best of a situation when all that you dreamed can't and won't happen? How do you create a project for a class and still show your artistry without a theater? More importantly, how do you stay connected with friends despite a distance? The biggest part of my high school experience are the friendships I've made. People I never thought I'd talk to are now some of my closest friends. People I met as an awkward freshman after four years are like brothers and sisters. I know I can always count on them to make me laugh when I'm down, cry when I really don't want to, and be confused by whatever antics they come up with. One tradition I've always enjoyed is the activity that comes at the end of the year, yearbook signing. There's something special about going up to your friends and asking them to sign your yearbook and you sign theirs. However, with the distance, yearbook signing morphed into an online platform where we submit typed letters. I did submit some typed letters and it was amazing being able to contact all of my friends. However, after submitting them, I felt something was missing. What I missed was the personal touch that came with a handwritten letter. So I did just that, and I wrote my closest friends letters reflecting on our friendship and cheering hopes for them in the future. Even though circumstances have changed and we don't know when the lockdown will truly end, this isn't goodbye, not yet. There are still 33 days until graduation and the rest of our lives to stay connected in all the places we'll go. Out there things can happen and frequently do to people as brainy and footsy as you. I'm sorry to say so, but sadly it's true. That bang ups and hang ups can happen to you. And when you're alone, there's a very good chance. You'll meet things that scare you right out of your pants. There are some down the road, between hither and yon, that can scare you so much you won't want to go on. Somehow you will escape. All that waiting and staying. You will find the bright places. Where boom bands are playing. Kid, you'll move mountains. You're off to great places. Today's your day. Your mountain is waiting. So get on your way.